All right, welcome back to another video. And as you can see, well, not clearly, but we have four and then five Celebrations ETBs going on one last Charizard hunt. So let's go ahead and put some to the side and just get all these guys open real quick. Personally, I just want to go on one last try for Charizard. I mean, that's obviously the big one. I pulled a couple good ones so far. Obviously, the Gold Mew, Shining Magikarp, Gold Star Umbreon, just to name a few. Still haven't gotten, like, the Rocket Zapdos, which is one for me that I would love. Let me grab all the packs out. Put box number one right there. Put all these regular packs so they're all chilling rain except for one put those to the side let's just count these up one two three four five six seven eight nine ten perfect let's get some of these opened up there these ones oh there's one hidden in there put those to the side i'm not going to open those ones here one two three four five six seven eight nine ten <clears throat> thank you for your patience i'm just gonna again i'm just gonna open the celebrations packs so that's gonna be 50 total there's not one Charizard in there, then I guess just not for me. So I think the ones that have Chilling Rain and whatnot probably are the ones that are like the second run, I'm guessing. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Two more, two more. Let's rather get it all done right now than wait even later. Yep, chilling rain. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And final box. And celebrations. It's four there. And again, I'm just going to put those to the side, maybe give them away. I'm not sure yet. We'll see. All right. Last box. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Cool. That's box one, four, three, two. And we'll start with box number one. Ah, that was a workout on its own, but let's get right to it. Thank you for your patience. Be a lot of code cards, a lot of repeats. Kygo, oh, Shining Magikarp. We're starting it off pretty good already. Good start already, a Shining Magikarp. Wonderful to be like one of my last boxes where I pulled a Shining Magikarp. Um, the Gold Star Umbreon and Gold Mew in one box. If it is, I will not complain. Palkia, Ho oh, Oh, Xerneas, Lunala. Nothing in that one. Okay. 
Dialga, Cosmog, Professor's Research. Cosmog, Clay Doll, and a Surf and Pikachu VMAX. That's pretty cool. Just put Clay Doll to the side. Hoping I also get a Rocket Zapdos. I know it's not valuable, like in the market or whatnot, but I still, you know, brings back memories from when I was collecting, especially when I was a kid. Kygor again. Let's see. Started off with a banger, and then it's been a little quiet since. But I guess you can't complain. Shiny Magikarp is one of the chase cards for a lot of people, so. <clears throat> oh, oh, Lugia. Oh, Blastoise. I will always take Blastoise. For me personally, the best starter Pokemon, Squirtle. This evolution, Blastoise. I actually do want to get... When I was younger, I had plenty of Blastoise. Never pulled a Charizard. But... Obviously, I never or don't have all my cards when I was a kid. So my goal is to buy like a, I don't know if I can afford a PSA 10 one day, but you know, even a PSA 8, maybe a 9, if I can get my hands on a PSA 9, that'd be awesome with Blastoise. Probably not first edition, because those are still pretty pricey, but even the regular would be nice. Kygor and then Surf and Pikachu. All right, two more. Get one more good one out of the box. Lugia, Reshiram. Here comes Team Rocket. Then Lunala. And then I'll review pretty much the boxes at the end of it, most likely. <clears throat> Full art Pikachu. That's cool. Well, box number one is pretty decent. Obviously, you got the Shining Magikarp and Blastoise, but let's jump on to box number two and see what we can get from there. So I'll say box number one was a good box. Shining Magikarp. Anytime you pull that, it's always a good day. Rocket's Admin Trainer. And a Mew. yet to touch any fusion strike it just doesn't interest me much at all so probably won't oh speaking of fusion strikes obviously the I guess you can say the the mascot of fusion strikes Mew pops up out of nowhere so maybe I should talk, talk about champions path or something and maybe Charizard will pop up Two packs though, and two hits. Pull our Pikachu again. Excuse the police, they're not looking for me. All right, nothing in that pack. Rom. Oh, Venusaur, there we go. And then a flying Pikachu again. <clears throat> so box one had Blastoise, box number two has Venusaur. Hopefully that means box three has a Fire Lizard. So 
So that Grom, Falkia, Fo'o, Lunala. It's funny too, because <clears throat> again, I never pulled a Charizard when I was younger. Somehow I just was never that lucky, no matter how many packs I opened. But the only Charizard I guess you can say that I pulled was out of the, um, was out of Evolutions. So it'd be nice to pull one out of Celebrations. But I also do have, hopefully, an uh, Ultra Premium Collection. I ordered on a Best Buy, or not Best Buy, uh, GameStop. I think it was like right before, like the day before Thanksgiving. Like it just released and I placed an order and I went through, but it, for the past you know couple weeks it's been processing and still hasn't had any movement. So, but I don't know what I'll do. We'll rush around. Nalo. <clears throat> I'm probably gonna keep it sealed, but I would definitely love to, you know, just hold the, the golden, or the gold Pikachu and the gold Charizard. I've seen plenty of pictures of them. They look so amazing. We'll see, though. I mean, first first things first is the order has to process. So we'll see from there. Rodon. Sigalio. <clears throat> All right. So Venusaur is probably the big hit out of that one. Let's put that over there. All right. Box number three. So box number one still probably the big winner so far. Flying Pikachu. Huh, interesting. I don't know why the back ones of these ones are. Unless they started doing that. Can I go? Oh, Kleffa. It's not bad. Not bad, not bad. I think I think I pulled this one before. I don't fully remember, but. <laughs> you might hear some Pokemon in the background. Figure this might as well set the mood. Yeah, these ones are all green for some reason. So far, they're green, I should say. Lugia, Groudon. Another professor's research. Most of these, uh, I think I got um, two from Best Buy, not Best Buy, GameStop. Uh, then the other one's from Target, I believe. A Sharam. It's not Sion, so nothing in that pack. This box so far has been a little too quiet. Rom, Palkia, and the Flying Pikachu VMAX. Gotten plenty of those so far. I was kind of hoping that, you know, box number one or two would have a Charizard in it so that way I can... Oh, Gold Star Embryon. There we go. There we go. Starting to heat up again. There we go. Good pull. Gold Star Embryon, second one I've gotten. Yeah, I was just hoping I'd have the, the Charizard already by now, just to, I'm not gonna say stress, but I would love to, oh, is that a Mew? Oh, Gardevoir EX. I personally have not pulled this one in a full art Pikachu. Pretty nice. Don't know the value of it, but I'll take it. Hey, it's a new card. I'm glad to see new cards that I haven't pulled yet. Zekrom, Yvetel, Nala. Rock 
Rocket. Past Professor Oak. Zamazenta V. Take that though. All right, last pack of box number three. Ram, Palkia, Professor's Research. So, three boxes in. Still don't have it, but you know what? Still got two more to go. So that was box number three. 20 more packs. 20 more packs. I'm trying to make it a little quick, just so that way, you know, it doesn't drag on too long. So now it's back to white codes, or white cards, I guess you can say. Tigor. Oh, Mewtwo EX. There we go. There we go. I like that a lot. I like it. Perfect. I will take that. Forgot about this one in the set. Have not pulled this one yet, so box four is already starting off pretty nice. Still remember watching Pokemon the first movie when I was a kid. And the first time seeing Mewtwo. Of course, when he sets Ash of Stone, Team Magma's Groudon. I've gotten that a couple times. But yeah, seeing him turn to stone and then every Pokemon just crying tears. I think every little kid had a cry at that moment. Palkia, Yoga, Mew. This will still need that Rocket Zapdos. Vettel. Xerneas, all right. Don fan, definitely have not pulled that. Who knows, maybe I could complete the Masters, but well, maybe, who knows. Oops, nice little Don fan. Remember when, a while ago in Pokemon Go when I first got it, and it was like one of my most powerful Pokemon. That was just something that I kind of just put in the gym to take space. Dialga, Zamazenta V. All right, four more packs. Charles are just hiding in the last box. Come on, open up. That one was a little difficult to open. Pull our Pikachu. <clears throat> Cosmog, Reshiram, Rocket Zapdos. Hey, I've been saying it all along. I'm gonna fool our professor's research. Happy with that. Stop complaining about Rocket Zapdos. It's definitely been a throwback box as far as the Mewtwo and the Zapdos, so why not finish it off with a Charizard? Palkia and a Flying Pikachu. All right, last pack of box number four. Foster Professor Zoak and Lunala. All right, last box. Last box for the Charizard. 
for me, if this is not it, then it's, it's probably not in the cards for me. Maybe it's just, I'm destined to never pull a Charizard in my life. Let me see some shine in the corner. Dialga, Yvetel, Cosmog. I don't know, I guess I didn't see anything. Maybe I was just blind. Pull our Pikachu. <clears throat> Ram, Rockets Admin, Solgelio. Alright. Reshiram, Zekrom, Flying Pikachu. Box number five, final box, been a little quiet so far. A little quiet so far. Birthday Pikachu, you know what, I'll take that. Probably about the third, third time I pulled it, but this is a card that does bring back memories for me, so. Six more, six more. Can't give a poke just yet. Ground on. And then another full art professor's research. Very fitting to have the Charizard be one of the final packs. Very, very fitting. Just teases me the entire time. If I don't, I mean, I may buy one. I don't know. It's a little tough when it's still a little over a hundred dollars to to get the Charizard. So this box has been a little quiet. Three more packs, though. Three more packs. Oops. Where's Sharam? Lugia, Surfing Pikachu. Final two. Final two. One of these two. Let's do it. All right. Let, well, I don't think it's this one. Another Reshiram. Ah, oh, it'd be very, very fitting to have Charizard be in this final pack. I won't complain, but it'll just be very, very fitting. All right, Palkia. Nothing, ah, oh, man. Well, obviously, it's a little disappointing. Wanted to go on one last Charizard hunts. Was a no for me. Um, but still pulled some nice ones. So box number one, Blastoise and a Shining Magic Harp. So that's not too bad. Um, box two, pulled the Venusaur out of it. Also the Mew and the Reshiram. Box three, Imposter's Professor Oak, Cleffa, and then Gold Star Embryon, and then Gardevoir EX, so solid box there. Imposter's Professor Oak, Donphan, Team Groudon, Mewtwo EX, and Zapdos, so box four I liked a lot because these are two cards that I really wanted. These are personal chase cards of mine. Pulled both of them in one box. And then box three, you know, birthday Pikachu, or box five, I should say, birthday Pikachu, so... Definitely the last box, probably the weakest one, but overall, you know, a lot of fun. Still went on one last Charizard hunt, you know, did the best I could, um, you know, with what I had. I do have more, but I kind of want to just keep them sealed, collect them, but man, mama didn't raise a quitter, so who knows? We'll see what happens in the future, but you know, if you'd like the video, definitely make sure to drop a like on the video. Make sure to sub to the channel as well. 
Appreciate you sticking around. Appreciate you, you know, watching me fail at trying to get Charizard um, in these five boxes. But again, sub to the channel. Make sure you drop a like on the video, and I'll see you another time.